his game. Hi there, everybody. I'm Dan Stevens, and welcome to the RCA Dome. My associate is Peter O'Keefe. Peter, both of these teams are expecting solid play from their linebacking core. Well, as well they should, Dan. Both teams have a talented cast of linebackers who have the speed and strength to really make their presence known on the field. The home players have a bunch of linebackers who can hit like Mack trucks. It may not seem nice, but when they knock you down, they want you to stay there. The visitors have a solid group of linebackers. These guys have a desire and a passion to win that helps sustain the entire team. Both of these groups have a chance to shine. The question is, which one? Well, all right, Peter, we'll keep our eye on them as the game progresses, but first, the coin toss. We choose heads. Heads it is. We'll see. Number 16, kicking off for the The ref team. gets the signal, and it's we're set. for football! Number 16 kicks it off to begin the game. Number 81 feels the opening kickoff at the 10. Bang down at the 36. Out on the field and will start this drive at the 36 yard line. One loses two and that brings up second down. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. They put a stop to this play behind the line of scrimmage. Pretty good call by the defensive coordinator. Agreed, Dan. They run it all locked up. That will bring up second down. White six gets yards. the call again and will gain close to six. White catches it in the flat and... Banks was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. And I'll tell you what, this looks like it wasn't that difficult to tackle, but he had his hands full. Yeah, looks can be deceiving, Dan. He really had to square himself perfectly to make that play. Number 90 takes the snap and punts it away. Number 11 fields the punt at the 16. Stop at the 33. Smith makes a play on this one and forces the incompletion. This is a guy I want on my secondary. You won't find many defenders who can disrupt a pass the way he can. And not only does he do it well, he does it often. Walker was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He bowling balls, or wide receivers for that matter. Well, Dan, we got an empty backfield, five receivers, and the defense is in their dime. Let's watch. the receiver and forces him to drop Number the ball. Incomplete. In fourth down coming Three. up. Still fans making their way through the turnstiles. They'll be just in time to catch the start of this game. Hello, I'm Dan Stevens and welcome to Seattle Stadium. By my side is my colleague, Peter O'Keefe. Peter, who do you have your eye on as we get set to start this game? Well, at the moment, I'm watching the sidelines, and I know one guy who wants a win to start the season outright. Marty Schottenheimer's a coach with a history of winning. Unfortunately, after a promising 8-8 eight eight year in 2002, the Chargers last season were a very ugly 4-12. Schottenheimer's got his work cut out for him if he's to turn the cellar-dweller Chargers into a contender. We'll see how his game plan unfolds once we get started, but first, the toss of the coin. Choose heads. It's tails. <laughs> Number 16, kicking off. There's the, the signal, and we're ready. It's time for Seahawks. Number 16 football. kicks it, and we are underway. Number 18 decides to take it out of the end zone. Stopped at the 17. 15-yard penalty from the spot of the foul. Number 20. Really yanked on that helmet back there. So the personal this drive at their 32-yard line. Number 44 catches it in the flat, and first he's just barely Seahawks. past the markers for a first. Number 44 keeps the party going after making the catch. 
right here. And now he's off for more. Coaches love receivers who believe his job is you won't see him running a post run, but you will see him make plays off his shorter catches. Number 32 Number gains 32, three yards, and that brings up second down. First down. Wilson has to resort to plan B on this play. That's why he gets the big box, Dan. He makes it happen no matter what. Oh, yeah, that scramble got him a nice game. Yeah. Wilson makes the pass, and the catch is made at the 15. And touchdown. Touchdown, Seahawks. 16 has a guy shadowing him but still manages to make the catch he beats his man Cole it's all about staking your turf that's his first touchdown of the day now the teams are out on the field getting loose the fans are filing in and finding their seats for the game hi there everybody I'm Dan Stevens and welcome to the Edward Jones Dome Peter O'Keefe is at my side, as usual, and Peter, this contest should not disappoint fans of the running game. Well, you got that right, Dan. We've got two premier backs today, each vying for the spotlight. Number 23 has one of the most exciting running styles in the game today, Dan. Quick cuts, fast in the open field, and most of all, elusive. A real finesse back. Number 28 is more of a versatile, all-purpose running back. Whether you're running a dive or a sweep, he'll rack the yards up for you. I'll tell you what, Dan, both these guys have potential to light it up today. Okay, Peter Rams send their offense out on the field and will start this drive at their own 20-yard line. Number 23, pitches it in the flat and he picks up nine. Number 23, easily outclassed his defender on that catch, and he had that play all the way. A nice run. And running a post route, which will see him make plays off of shorter catches. Number 23, cruises out to the left side, and... Number 23, sticks close to his blockers here, and it pays off. Nice second down call, and they will move the chain. Oh, no. This pass will... Ball harmlessly to the ground and it's, it's incomplete. Switch. Number nine throws this one right sideline and first it's caught at the 47 and he's stopped right there. That will bring up first down. Number nine makes a terrific completion in double coverage here. Wow, now that is one confident QB. A well designed play there. Peter, and they will move the chain. Right. Ten makes the nice ran. catch, and he's got the first down and a whole lot more. Number 26 finally makes the play, but not in time. Let's have another look. Oh, yeah, gave up a lot of yards before forcing him out of bounds. And Peter, that time, neither... Throws the pass and touchdown it's ran. cut for the yeah. score. Come on, give it up. Yeah, baby. Touchdown. Yeah. What? That's what I'm talking about. Number nine. Here's this one out beautifully. That's how you throw the ball, Dan. Take notes, all of you want to be quarterback. Right on the money, Peter. He is just a fantastic passer. The fans are finding their way to their seats, uh, those who really own those seats, as we get set to begin this exciting game. and welcome to Arizona Stadium. Peter O'Keefe is next to me in the booth, and Peter, we've got a couple of offensive powerhouses down on the field. No doubt about it, Dan. We could be in for a high-scoring game today. Murray is a quarterback with excellent mobility. If he doesn't see something happening downfield or the pocket breaks down, he doesn't mind scrambling in the least. He's not the only big-time player on that squad, though. Number 10 is one of the better receivers in the league. He's one of those players that a defense has to key in on and respect 
Otherwise, he's going to make you pay. A talented duo to be certain. They just might make the difference out there. Well, all right, Peter. We'll keep our eye on them as the game progresses. But first, the coin toss. Heads. It's tails. It's a hot, balmy day. The players need to remember to stay cool and hydrated out here to avoid heat stroke and exhaustion. Back to you guys. Thanks, Susie. The Cardinals will start this drive at their own 22-yard line. Stop at the 26. Number 97 with the tackle. Number 10 goes in motion. Throws the pass and it's caught at the 47, 25, 10. Finally stop at the one. It'll be first and goal. Number 10 makes the catch and then adds a whole lot more on the ground. Watch. Reels it in and then makes the D reel with all the yards he's tacking on. And Peter, that time, neither of those guys. The question of who wants the ball more. Advantage offense there. Connor, Connor will get stopped at the line. Murray lobs this to the end zone and it's cut for a touchdown. touchdown. room for error on this one. It's either a great pass and completion or an interception. Let's take a look. Well, that's a great catch and a great... The fans are finding their way to their seats, uh, those who really own those seats, as we get set to begin this exciting game. Hello, I'm Dan Stevens, and welcome to Pro Player Stadium. With me, my colleague, Peter O'Keefe. Peter, this game features a big-time matchup between an elite wide receiver and a defensive back who's one of the best in the league. That's right, Dan, and you've got to figure they'll be seeing a lot of one another today. Number 17, he's a very gifted receiver. He uses his remarkable speed to burn defenders and make big plays. And here on the other side is another top-tier player. Howard is a star cornerback. His exceptional leaping ability enables him to get up high and bat down or intercept passes. It should be one heck of a matchup. It'll be interesting to see who gets the upper hand. Okay, Peter, we'll see how they do once the game begins. But first, the toss of the coin. I choose tails. 